Hi guys, Happy New Year! Um, this is the first video I'm making for the new year. Um, and I hope you guys like... Well, I love my new background. Um, it has like Taylor Swift right there, the poster that I got from her Reputation album. I love that album. <laughs> got these lights from Target and the sheep is from my baby brother that made it in his um, Catholicism classes. And uh, I got a new church calendar, so it's not Taylor Swift anymore, but it is from my Catholic faith, so really love, love that. Um, I wanted to provide a quick update on my 12 pens of Christmas, which I never got into doing because I got so busy with everything, especially with the holidays. So if you want to continue watching, which are the products right here, then um, keep on watching. One of the first products I wanted to use up was this Bath & Body Works perfume, which I made a huge progress from my last update because last update was here and now I'm here. So by the end of this month, I'll be done with it. Um, it's such a beautiful scent. And I really love the red color because not only does it remind me of Taylor Swift's album Red, um, the color is just very nice um, in general. So that is one of my products. <laughs> this is one of my products here. <laughs> that was my Wet n Wild um, Reserve Your Cabana, which as you can see, um, I don't know if you could tell from the lighting, but I did hit a dent right here. Um, it's such a beautiful highlighter just to use every day. Would I ever repurchase it? Probably not. Um, just because of how huge this pen is. It makes it seem like you're just using a product over and over again. And I feel like... If it was much smaller, it would be easier to use up, but it's not, and it's an okay product for me. This lip product, my third item, is from Revlon, which is called Romantic. It no longer has a label because I've been using it, but as you can see, I have made some progress right here, and I really, really, really love this shade. I mean, it's beautiful. Hi guys, so sorry for the, um, uh, for the pause, and this is like a whole different background, um, but something came up. Um, so the last thing I was talking about was this product, which I was trying, um, to explain how much I love it, and I still do to this day, so there's my progress update with that. The shade is absolutely beautiful. I would completely repurchase this if I ever use it up, which I know I will because of how beautiful the shade is. Um, it's like a red tint in my lips. Like even if um, I wear it throughout an eight hour work shift at my job, um, this still comes through and it leaves such a natural red looking tint on my lips and I love that. I love it so much it doesn't dry them out. Um, so this one is a shade in Romantic by Revlon and they still carry this. Um, this other product is from Modern Renaissance and I have not been using it as much as I've wanted to because I haven't been using eyeshadow recently. So this is just the update I have, you could see that I hit almost pen with this shade called Antique Bronze. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I really love this palette. Um, if I ever run out of it, I know I would repurchase this. Just because the colors are completely beautiful. Um, so there's nothing much to say about this palette, but I will be keeping this for sure in my collection. I 
did replace my foundation with um, Neutrogena because the other one was expired from two years ago. So I threw that away. I could show an insert of a picture right now. And so anyway, I have been using this Healthy Skin Liquid Makeup in the shade Buff. I'm in the shade Buff. And I really, really love the finish to this foundation. I'm sorry. I'm sick. Um, I think my voice changed for some reason. Um, anyway, the shade matches perfectly on me and I love the finish to this. Um, I will keep using this until I finish it. As you can see, I pretty much, you know, try to use it up as best as I could. So there it is right there. I'm sad that they don't make this shade anymore, which is called Mom's the Word, because it creates such a beautiful finish on my eyelids. And, um... I'm not sure if I'm going to be throwing it away just yet because looking at it through my hand, I feel like I could still get it to work on my eyes um, just by using my finger because all this time I've been using a brush. So I'll use it today and see how it works. This other one from Flower Beauty is my highlighter Chubby. Stick and Gold Coaster, which I have not been using since my last update. Here's the progress that I have in it. There's still quite a lot of product left, but because I've been working so late and I've been going back to school, I haven't been putting on makeup that much. And it includes this, um, but I really love how subtle this highlighter can be. It's a beautiful, beautiful shade, and, you know, yellow gold highlighters are normally not something I go for, but this one's very subtle, so I really recommend this for, you know, anyone, really. And, yeah. This red one lipstick I did not use. I've used maybe a couple of times, but as you can see, the shade is still just the same. Did not use this one, which is called Wine With Everything. Neither did I use my ColourPop eyeliner in Sweet Tooth. Um, again, I'm not um, into eyeliners that much, so this did not get used by me too much. This ColourPop... Sorry. Um, this ColourPop eyeshadow on Birthday Girl, I absolutely love. I love, love, love so much. Um, I love putting this over my eyeshadow looks, um, during the day or night. And it just brings my whole look all together. So I would repurchase this, um, if I got the chance to. My dreaded baby lips. It's still with me, um, and this is the progress I've had so far with it. I am almost there, but ugh, this thing is just like, it's taking me forever to try to use this up. Um, I just, I guess like, I just don't like the color, that's why I just want it to go away. But I'm halfway there, um, hopefully by the end of this month it's gone, but... We'll see. And this last product is from Maybelline, which is called The Great Lash. And I haven't been using mascara too much, so I still have some left in here. But would I ever repurchase it? Probably not, because um, I feel like it does smudge underneath my eyelid, like it flakes or something. So that is it for all of... um my 12 pounds of Christmas I have probably used maybe one item out of the products I use but I realize like what I like and what I don't like 
and for sure I don't like baby lips this color which is called raw raw red it was limited edition so but all the rest I know like um it would take some time to try to use that up and you just gotta be patient with using up your makeup but if you really really love a product um it won't seem like a chore to do it you know because i really love the modern renaissance palette and i really love the revlon lip balm and romantic those are just a given for me that i really enjoy so thank you to jacqueline thank you to everyone who um participated in this project pan it was quite exciting to see a lot of of the videos that these people are making they seem really wonderful um at least for the ones i watched i didn't get to see everyone's because you know with the busyness with the holidays and now i'm going back to school um i don't really get the chance to watch videos as much as i want less than make them so thank you so much for watching i hope um you have a great rest of your day or night and i will see you guys whenever i see you bye